Hello, welcome back. Last time I untangled a complicated snarl of wolfmen, and uh, it did eventually arrive at what I feel is about as optimal a solution as I could get with what I currently know. I have a kite shield now. Can't hold it over my head and fly or anything, but it does block things pretty well. I also still have this buckler in case I want to dampen damage by less, which, you know, there could be reasons for that. Right, so, uh, my optimal play has put me at 1 HP and 4 points from a level up. There's nothing easy I can go back for to level up. What was through here? Just so that I remind myself. A key way up high. I currently have one of those. I can't tell if I've been up there myself or not. I think I have. That's where the giants are, right? Giants. Trolls. And giant trolls. Um, I don't really have a reason to be here, but this will lead back around anyway, so it's fine. My, uh... <laughs> I had a thought there. <laughs> I don't anymore. There's a chest here. It's full of mystery. Don't know what's in it. Um... Could I, like, stomp on your head and hit you from there? Well, head doesn't count as behind. But let's find out if I can. Can I attack downward? Yes, okay. That actually might open up the possibility of taking out a... Uh... Well, actually, if I'm doing this... Does this line up with the key? It does. That would do way too much damage to me, obviously, but... I could, in theory, drop from there... Or here and then there, I guess would be the least damage. And have a key for a lot of fall damage. Okay, so that key is accessible to me. If I'm willing to spend, you know, like, 12 tiles or so's worth of fall damage, I can get a key. Um, hold on, can I one-shot that dude? Not with the... Vigor ring on. I would need the power ring. But that is one option for... Refilling my health. Uh, anyway, if I were to go forward... What could I do? In fact, there was a down ladder here that I haven't really looked at. Um, can I attack you from here? No, too far away. And from here, I wouldn't kill you. Okay. And you, same status, right? One short? No, I can take you. Oh, okay. Here we go. This is a uh, easy, free way to level up. I mean, it's not free, but it's pretty close. With this sword... Oh, this was the one that was off by one, right? Yeah, off by one with this sword. But, you know, if I just accept one great sword hit, I can just, just do that. However, I've never looked here. There's a flameling there. There's a flameling that I can access there. However, I still couldn't, like, one-shot it or anything. Alright, so place to fight flamelings. Uh, I can access two of those, but not this one. Yet. Ooh, Grey Serpent. Okay, you're serious. Uh, Cave of Origin, by the way. Okay, that's fun. I wonder what's going to happen when I get down to the bottom of that. I don't suspect that's the whole zone, but may or uh, whole game, but maybe this is just like made for replays. And I don't know. I... I have a feeling it's going to be a lot longer than that. Guardian, you say? Level 28, okay. I mean, with some work I could probably take you. Alright, so I'm pretty sure I'm using my great sword on that skeleton up there. The only thing that looks close to suboptimal there is that I could do it with just one uh, hit of the long sword if I were already one level up. But this is good enough as it is. Vigor Ring means I have eight more health points available here than... Oh, hi, Gatekeeper. You're boss too. I can tell. Oh, would you? I wonder. Nah, you don't hit the switch. <laughs> it kind of looked like you were gonna. <laughs> Alright. Um, so yeah, that'd be a fun fight. Level 30. Looks like that. This is something I would like to do. So that's my next major goal. Having leveled up, okay, so what do I want to do? So if you are my, like, main target of next whatever, 
Oh boy, how am I going to work this out? How many arrows do I have? Five? Alright. That's not a lot. I got a lot of repair tools, but that won't help with, like, if I'm just going to die if I fight something. I can go here. Okay, that would have been better than, uh... I guess this is actually what I want to load, sure. Uh, we'll wait, autosave. No, that's not what I want to load. I want to load... Save one. Since I know I can do that to the flameling there... Wait, hang on. Is that better? What does it look like with longsword? Not as good. Yeah, okay, that's more optimal. Like, I'm getting... <laughs> I'm less close to being able to do this than I was with the- Whoa! That thing explodes. Okay. Uh, oh, I- right, okay, right. <laughs> Can't stand on it anymore, so I had to- had to fall. Uh, so now I can one-shot that skeleton. And yes, that ends up with one hit on longsword, one on the greatsword, rather than two hits on the greatsword, so that's better. Uh, I do want to do this now, I'm fairly certain. So experience is there. I didn't look at all down there, but also remind me what's here. Guardian, and nothing to do anyway. Bardor, can be opened elsewhere. There. Uh, that's where I get to if I fall from the gatekeeper. Let's check the cave of origin for a bit. See what I can learn down here. Ooh, Nidhogg. Okay, you look like boss three, possibly. Real serious. Also, I could go over you if I could, like, grapple from here to here or something. Alright, I do have a key. This is an exploration run, so I'll happily do stuff like, say, I don't know, this. Do it. Uh, do it. Whoosh! And you know what? Let's, uh... Whoosh, whoosh. That last one was super unnecessary. Enough that, even on an exploration run, I will switch back. Celeste. Bo. Sword. Sword, sword. Probably. Yeah, that'll hurt a lot. It's fine. Just want to know. All right, this is an obvious throwing axe situation, but like, <laughs> that's only gonna do so much. Still, no, that was uh, that was actually pretty good. So for all of these, if I bow once, I can then just long sword. All right, can't get there. So anything that is so important here that I would actually come now. Uh, am I out of throwing axes? I am. Well, I'm almost out of arrows too. Yeah, so I don't. I think this is as far as I can go. Maybe. Maybe I can. Uh... Let's see. That does kill you. I did level up. Zero out of ten. I can still do this for a bit. A key, and that's it. So there's nothing I can do here right now? Is that what I'm seeing? Seems like it. That's just gonna kill me. Okay, well, um. Careful to press the right thing. Confirm quick load. Alright, Cave of Origin is clearly not for me right now. Till I'm ready to take Nidhogg or, like, something else. This is clearly not for me, so I really just gotta get the Gate Guardian. What was he called? Gatekeeper or something? Alright, um, so if I were to do that... Boots at a next hit, plus eight. Do I want to attempt to level up, or am I ready to actually just try this now? 
So you'd hit me for 26. That's a hefty hit. Uh, if I took that hit right now... I could swap rings without losing anything and hit harder with my bow. You will give me 30 experience, so I'm leveling up anyway. So that might have been a waste of a kite shield hit. But let's see how close I am to actually killing you now as, as it is. So every arrow... Puts me here where I would have to drink at least one potion. 13 hit. You have 49 left. I could axe you, but this is a bad... Uh, would that hit twice since you're too wide? Yes, it would. That's neat. Okay, I ran out of arrows. Okay, that would give me Awas. You acquired Awas, the balance rune. Through balance, one may find the strength to enter a new level of profundity. Trade gained bloodlust, instant kills restore HP. I wonder if that trait's going to be the same if I reload. That's neat. Awas, balance. Oh. Wait. Ah, okay. So my MP is 20 now. Did that restore? I'll bet it did. So first of all, this would definitely be the time for a Soul Blast. Um, does the ring enhance that? So if I do it now, it's... Well, that was 40, right? 85, 125... I don't think the ring helps with that. Soul Blast, Hagalaz, cast, 85, okay. Uh... So if I'm Soul Blasting... I probably can do this now and not, uh, something. Um, okay, right. If I, since I am leveling up, I want to spend... I can't take this all the way off, right? I can! That's actually perfect. Okay, so I want to do this. Hit with no defenses, get myself to one. I'll put that back on just for convenience. Feels like it makes sense to spend all my arrows. Um, I now want the other ring. For most of these hits, just not the last one, because I'll be leveling up and I want all my stuff back. Okay, uh, so five arrows. Yes, that does affect. What about the axes? They're pretty good. So that's 26 hit on one. There are more of those available in some places, but like I can just buy more arrows. How's my gold? 70? That's not bad. Could also use some of these potions I have. I feel like I'd rather buy arrows because I can't get those as easy out in the world. I don't think my route yet has necessarily involved drinking one of these. I've so far done a no healing potion run, if I'm not mistaken. Okay, so uh, how many arrows would I have to spend? If it's 12 each, you're at 69. All of my arrows would take you down to uh, 19, and I'm hitting for... 18 with this! Ah! Okay, so don't spend all your arrows, because then you'll end up one short. I mean, more short if I'm doing that. Does that affect throwing X? Seemingly not? Okay, yeah, the throwing axes are a real good deal. So 26 hit for each one. Same amount he hits me for. With the kite shield. Okay, so 26. Twice. It's 52, which takes you down to 17. Which is <laughs> one short with this ring equipped. <laughs> I wonder if all these are in purpose or if it's just coincidence that I keep landing one short. 
What about, let's see, so the bow does 12 damage per arrow. All right, I'm gonna ax once. You're at 43. With this, I hit for how much? One more time, 16. All right, so that'd just be one, two, three, I guess. Uh, and then I can save something's durability. I probably need some weapon on or another. I do. This one is enough. Okay, I think I accept this circumstance. MP0, MP20. It is a full restore. Great. Just like using a spirit gem. Awas, the balance rune. Through balance, one may find the strength to enter a new level of profundity. Bloodlust, okay, same trait. It says random traits. I assume that's either just unspecified at the start, but always the same, or perhaps like seeded. Like when I create the character, it decides which traits I'll get at each one. Yeah, clearly this is not the, the end because I still have two runes to get. Okay, so I have barrier. Uh, I know about that. The Makara had it up. And, you know, presumably same as Mythbearer. Myth barrier. 50 hit. Soul volley. 16 MP. So that's using both runes at once. Okay. That just tells me which spell will be cast. So this is spell selection. So that means there are 16 spells. Fifteen. None for all runes and equips, of course. Alright, um... I think I'm pretty happy with this. I'm gonna save. Yeah, no runes equipped. Okay, fifteen spells. I do have the sixteen MP to cast this now. Let's at least see, since I saved, what does it look like? Ranged, okay. Uh, it does open that. Not what I was hoping. Um, I still want to have done that because it gave me MP and stuff, which is real nice. I don't think that's what I desire. Maybe the mobility thing will be a spell. That would make some sense, wouldn't it? Alright, my arrow supply is a little low. It's a lot low. Might want to do something about that. Do I want to fight you? Not now. Okay, so down here is water. Oh, hi! Stigander showed up. I've searched high and low, yet I remain lost. Could being lost be the answer we seek? Okay, so that does get me to new stuff. Slime, level two. Oh, all right, let's uh, go there. Um, so Stigander, having shown up, I, I don't need to go down here right now. I'll go later. Can't reach you. I wonder if any of my other companions have uh, moved. All right, let's try this. My save is good enough up there. I can't get you from the back. So you'll be serious when I'm ready. You won't. Uh, I'll take this off. I don't need to take off the shield because you won't be hitting me. So lock door to open. Odd wall. Whoa! That's creepy. Is that the one who's selling me these? Moonwater, Flame Brew, Age Decker, great. And then... Oh boy. Uh, okay. So, okay. <laughs> Probably, are you the owner of this hand? It's hard to tell. So additional greatsword, additional kite shield, uh, axes, oh nice, so I can buy those. They're very, very good. Same price as the other shop for arrows. I suspect I really want to buy one of each of these. That sounds like a great purchase. Rune wand, half MP cost. Oh. Oh. Okay, so I could afford this and this. 
My durability is looking fine for now, and I have lots of repair tools, and I can just buy those. Although it, uh, these are fresh greatsword and kite shield. Repair tool would take a, the max durability down by 10, I think. Uh, I mean, yes, yes, I want this. That's Those are my purchases. Those are extremely useful tools. Maybe I should have saved for axes instead of arrows, because axes are kind of better, but eh, it depends on the situation. Realistically, though, axes kind of are just better. Hmm. Depends on the situation. If I can't, like, get in line with the thing I'm throwing at, then, then I can't attack it anyway. So yeah, axes pretty much are just better, aren't they? Ooh, flame brew plus axe, if those work together, would be potentially very good. That'd be a way to... Well, I wonder if it just multiply the first, or add to the first axe hit. Okay, so uh, interesting st uh, stuff down here. I'd like to know at least... Yeah, I'm, I'm happy with those purchases. I'm saving. I would like to know what this is. It's a buckler. Okay. Interesting. Two more shield slots there. A lot more weapon slots. I wonder if those are all just overflow or what? Anyway, I don't uh, want to have spent that key there right now. I assume there are enough keys in the game to unlock all the doors. Ooh, a throne. Key up there, completely out of my reach. Guardian looking closer to plausible. Okay, let's test something. Soul Volley, cast. Does not penetrate, okay. Now I know. This does not connect to a place I know. It goes farther down. Have I been there? I think no. Uh, but I can go. Oh shoot, I have to go through you on the way out. Well, I'm committed to this now. I mean, I can take him. How much will he uh, experience me up? Eight. That's not enough. Extra long sword. So it's extra long. Uh, okay, so open this to open the way to Presumably both of those, but maybe only one. Or if I could fall, I still wouldn't get to that. Troll guarding something. Hmm. Okay, well, I'm going to have to do this one way or another. It's pretty much just going to be this way. I don't think there was a lot I could have done to make that better. I can do this now. Okay, um, where am I going? What am I doing? I need to fight Nidhogg at some point. Down here, there's nothing else of interest, right? Yeah, you're pretty serious at 251. Wow. I need so many keys. More than I have. Hmm. Is this... does this mean something? Can I, like, go through there? This this part's darker than this part, in case, like, video encoding makes those look the same or something. Okay. Yeah, I'm a little unclear on where I'm going and what I'm doing right now. I need to level up, so let's just go back and, like, clean up some stuff. So, plus six. I would survive this, but only just. Which, you know, is kind of ideal. I can take the wolfmen, though, right? Well, but if that's ideal, and if I can take a wolfman with, uh... Something. Um... Okay, that's ideal. Mimic. So stomping on the top of a mimic is a way to wake it up and look at its stats without it hitting me. I'd love to know how to get to you. 
but currently I don't. I do need a great sword for this, apparently. That would level me up, so great sword and this works perfectly. Is there a more profitable one of those I can do? Can't get to your back. You have a potion. I mean, technically that is more profitable, so yes. Let's get a flame brew. Sure. Alright. Greater knowledge. Yeah, working on it. Um, what was over here? Mysteries. Have you changed what you say? Yes. I'm afraid my stocks have run dry, friend. Don't worry. I know of a great place to replenish. What's up with your repair tool? Oh, all these mysteries. Maybe the mobility upgrade is a, uh, a, uh, a teleport spell, and I can just, like, go down four tiles and something. You're clearly a mimic. I leveled up. You got a key. I'm really in need of those. Let's, uh... 3138. 3137. 10 damage. Hit again for that. I think that's fine with me. Okay. I got some money for that. Alright, a key. If I get like seven more of those, I might be happy. So, Garm's Pit. I left a sunstone there to remind me of a place to come back to when I can cross gaps because there was a, a hidden door in a place I didn't understand. Okay, so how do those skeletons look in that one spot, I wonder? I think I did everything up here, that's where the kite shield was, and i pretty sure I cleared that room. I guess I could check. Skeletons are not here. There are some hollow souls, though. I could shoot them, but I got better stuff to do with my arrows, probably. Like, there's gotta be a way to you. This dragger I can take easily. That's a good target. What am I leveling up for? Nidhogg, I guess? Uh, yeah, this seems right. Oh, and at this point I should do this. Uh, I forget what was there. It doesn't matter, though. Okay, so I think this room is of some interest. From the back, yes. From the front... Not quite. You hitting me for 11 is pretty much ideal, though, so let's do that. I would like this passage open. Sure, I can do it this way around. Doesn't make a difference. Oh, it does, though. Wait. This is better? Yes, it is. No, wait, that's the same... Because I had... Which sword did I use on those? I forget. Anyway, this is the way around that I want it. I think I did use my greatsword improperly. Okay, so one health. I th think I have something I can kill for free to get that back. If I save here, can I then reset the room? Yes. Alright, so if I don't have something I can kill for that, then I can load that save. Alright, um... Hmm. What do I think I can kill for that, actually, now that I think about it? Maybe nothing? Well, hi there, Shade. What are you doing there? You're new! Things have changed. 
plus zero, so you're just in my way. 32. <laughs> of course. Uh, okay, so... We got a new world up here. Shades that don't give experience. They're just kind of in my way. My friends have moved on. But now if I want to go back... I can't as easy. Okay, there was nothing to kill up here. Um, there's one mushroom somewhere guarding some moon water across a pit that I can't even uh, do anything about, so... I'll leave that as it is. What I need to know is if I can get out of this one HP pit I've put myself in. Without... well, I mean, I, I always have arrows and axes and stuff, so... Maybe there's a good place to use those. In fact, wasn't there, like, a perfect spot for... My grand total of profits was one key there, by the way. And a bunch of experience and stuff. Uh, yeah, there was a spot down in, uh, Cave of Origin. Where there were a bunch of serpents I could hit or something. Okay, so you're there. That's a mimic. Can't deal with it right now. So yeah, I had other options than to get myself down to one health with those skeletons. I might want to take those options. I'm not sure yet, though. No one to fight over here. There's you. I can just take you. There we go. Okay, that's my free experience. I thought there was some somewhere. So that's more than acceptable. I uh, will want to change rings and change swords. And then that becomes pretty good. Okay. There we go, all healed up. Level 15, attack 29. Okay, but then what? I mean, I guess I need to gear up for Nidhogg. I partially opened a, that skeleton way i kind of like to take you, just because I I want to. Um, you would hurt me some, though. It's not necessarily time for that yet. So when I have ten health to spend, that's a good place to spend it, probably. Or if I have, like, twenty-two health to spend, I can do it there. There are trolls guarding a chest in another spot. Anything could be through here. This could be the place I need to go. There was that one guardian way back that I could probably take now and maybe do something productive with. All right, but I'm gonna have to decide to spend a key somewhere sometime. Where was that shop that I saw? It was hidden away in, uh, it was past the gatekeeper? Yeah, past the gatekeeper, right? I like how I never feel like I can really just go on a rampage and feel good about everything. It's just like, the, the pressure never lets up here. And I don't know, I think that's... For a game like this, that just somehow works better for me than, like, the way Mythbearer was. It was great, but it was a much, much easier, like, casual, rompy sort of experience. This is so much more serious. Okay, yeah, so, uh, just for knowledge, since I am indeed here, let's find out what's in chest number two. I guess I can see if a chest is a mimic by whether I can walk through it or not. Chest number two has a repair tool. First one buckler, second one repair. Got it. Okay, and there's none of this that I want to buy right now. That looks real nice. It's going to cost me five keys total. And further something, though. Hmm. Alright, uh, so I'll work on untangling this snarl. Like, whatever it is, I, I don't know what I need to do next. I'm gonna have to just, like, look at all my situations and figure out what makes sense. I guess there's new stuff to see up here through three guardians. That's a lot of guardians. 
There's a bunch of new stuff in a lot of places. I probably want to spend keys down in Cave of Origin. Do I, though? There was, like, nothing there for me except Nidhogg, though. So I don't know, maybe I want to spend here and try to go through that troll? Okay, so once again, just so I know... I mean, I can do this next time. <laughs> but just so I know, that opens both of those. Great, okay. That's all I wanted to know. All right, uh, let's make a proper save. I'll go uh, here then, sure. Rotate through that way. Yeah, I'll see you next time to figure out what I'm doing. <laughs>